Hello. Hello. Hey. hey guys. What's up? What's up? Welcome back to the vlog today. We're stoked you're here. Today um, is actually a very special day. Why is today special day? Because Sunny is going to get in the water for the first time in oh, the yeah. ocean. <laughs> that is a special day. I yes. think Jack was about, well actually Jack was younger when he got in the first time I think. Yeah, we've been a little more delicate oh, no. with Sunny. <laughs> I was going to say in the house. In the house, more. that too. For some reason I feel like Sun Sunny's just a little more timid. Like, timid? She's just a girl. She's more fragile. I don't just know. She is little. She's tiny. But we're going to take her today. And we have some exciting news to share with Very you guys. Very exciting news. We'll get to that later. Big things but. happening. First off, we need to clean our room. It's it, mostly the bathroom. The bathroom. And you want to know what is okay, funny you know here? What? You know what? This, this. I know that's mine. That's yours. I know that's mine. That's not mine. Okay, I know that's mine. But I already <laughs> cleaned up your stuff that was in here last night, so it's like a head start. Oh my god. Anyway, what we've been doing to decide who does things that we don't want to do. <laughs> <laughs> is playing matchmasters against each other and whoever wins doesn't have to do it. So anyway. whoever loses today gets to clean this whole thing up. And also special thanks to matchmasters because they're sponsoring this whole video today. And we are doing a giveaway with them. If you want to enter the giveaway, you click the link in our caption and you're going to download the game. And then when you log in, it's going to give you a special Beast and Fam calendar. And every single day, you're going to get a free gift in the game. And then you can be entered to win an Amazon gift card. There's gonna be five Amazon gift cards given out and they're all $200 each. And then we'll shout you out on our page. Anyway, we're stoked. So basically Matchmasters is like a match three puzzle game, but ideally you wanna get like four or five. These right here are your boosters. And before every game, you get to pick a booster that you're gonna have throughout the whole game. So I'm gonna do this little guy. If you collect seven blue stars on your turn, then your booster gets full and then you can activate your booster. I activate my booster. Ooh, that's cool. <laughs> He's munching. And it's giving me a ton more points. And then whoever has the highest score at the end of the match wins. Yeah. <laughs> I won! You won! But now Derek and I are gonna play each other to see who has to clean the room and the bathroom. Speeders has challenged you to play. Speeders. What's your name? Derek. Oh, what? We can go. Booster activated already with another three star. I don't know if this is luck or if I'm just actually really good. Okay, okay. Booster activated. Wait, what is your oh, booster? Oh, that's cool. What the? Oh, I just passed you. Time oh my taken. gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Booyah! Sarah won. I was already gonna clean I gotta the room say, anyways. That, I was no, gonna you were. Yes, I was. <laughs> that was a really good match. It is a very fun game. Again, don't forget to click the link in our description. Download Matchmasters. Get it going. <laughs> Are you guys ready for the beat? No, we are not. This is so freaking hard to get out of the house. Gotta load up the car. Gotta get them in the car. <sighs> this is an endeavor. Okay, let's get in the car. Let's go get in the car, okay? So it officially takes us about, um, oh my gosh. I smell like rotten onions. Oh. I'm not kidding. Sarah. Okay, I don't know if any of you moms have experienced this, but I have zero smell when I'm pregnant. Like I just, I would like to think I smell pretty pleasant, but postpartum, I am the <laughs> smelliest person under my arms. Even after I shower, I like stink. Nice. It's, I heard it's normal, but also I'm just shocked every time. Anyway, it takes us like an hour and a half to get out the door these days with two kids. Really great. Why is it so hard to get out the door? I don't know. We're on our way. We haven't been in like a week, so this will be good. We made it. We made it. With We're here. all the peeps. We got our little Sunny's setup. chilling on a surfboard. Sunny, you're surfing. Woo! Jack's over there with his floaties, just playing with all the big kids. Wait, where's Jack? Oh, so he's got a girl. Yeah, yeah. go Jack! This place is awesome. Just a massive pool for all the kids. And what's up, Knox? Go Jack! Girls, I love when the older girls are here because they totally just like take him. He hits on the older girls, I, I swear. No, he does not. Yes, he likes the older no, girls. No, he does not. Yes, he does. They're just nice to him. Maybe we I are going to put it. Sunny in the water for the first time. Okay, Sunny, are you ready? You ready to try? I'll go with you. Okay, girl. Ready for a little dip? Try a little one? Ready? Oh. 
Oh, what do you think? What do you think? Ah, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. 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 It's just a little yeah. water. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. Lost the binky. Oh. oh, okay. That's yeah. it. Oh, it's too cold. Here, now I hold you. Look, look it's okay. Oh, she doesn't. she's a warm water girl. Just like your mom. <laughs> All right. No more. All done. No Good ocean. job, sunny girl. Sun bad. Bad. Sun bad for little Sunny. The sun came out and so we just went right back under the umbrella. I would say her first dip in the ocean was like Jack's. Was a, a major success. Did you like that girl? You are like your mother. Did you like that? You don't oh, like it. <laughs> oh no. You liked it. <laughs> she didn't. <laughs> this position, why does she like this? I don't know, she likes that. <laughs> She's so cute. Sunny, you went in the ocean for the first time. Where's Jack? Okay. Where is he actually? I do that ten times. Where is he? Every two minutes I do that. Oh, oh, cool. So with the older girls. Still loving the older girls. Alright, we made it home. Sunny just took a nap. I need a snack. Did you have a good time today, Sarah? No. <laughs> if you haven't figured this out by now, one of Sarah's biggest pet peeves, she always gets mad at me if I put the camera in her face when she is not hungry. expecting it or hungry. I'm just hungry. We haven't eaten all day though. Okay. <laughs> Stop. Hey. 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 Yes. Hey. What? How does it feel to be filmed? It's a little bit uncomfortable. Face. Uh huh. Are you just eating mac and cheese? What are you doing? There's what? cheese on my lips. Oh my gosh. Why don't you tell him about your knee? As you guys know, Derek had his knee appointment. He got his MRI done. Tell him what you found out. I hurt my knee really bad, my left knee. I figured something was wrong with it, but I wasn't entirely sure. And I thought I'd go in and get an MRI on this one and this one because for the past two years, this one has hurt me really bad. I found out that I have to get surgery on both knees. Keep in mind, he has had surgery on both knees before. I had surgery on this knee, torn meniscus, surgery on this knee, torn meniscus, both several years ago. No, That's really all I need sad. to know. I have to get surgery, so we're so trying to like decide when we're going to get the surgery. I was gonna do it immediately, but we have some exciting news. Other news. We are going to Australia. Australia. <laughs> no, Can this you speak is an Australian accent. Nar. 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 So at the end of the month, we are packing up. We are going to Australia for three weeks, but it's crazy because the flight is like 10 hours there and then we have another two hour flight once we get there. But the total travel is like 14 hours. We're going and we to have Australia. friends going. We have friends yes. that are going too and so we're like, let's go at the same time as them. We're going to Gold Coast. That's gonna be fun. Anyways, so I was trying to decide, should I get the surgery now and like be healed just as we're leaving to Australia because it's not a terrible uh, recovery. But you'd still like probably wouldn't fully be healed. So yeah. we made the decision that we're probably going to do it after. I think Sunny just woke up. Girly, hi. Hi, Sunny girl. There you are. <laughs> Why are you so cute when you wake up? Hey, Dad. Jack, will you tell everyone where you're going to go when you're older? On the what is it? To where? The moon. What? Are you going to be an astronaut? Yeah. He wants to be an astronaut. He actually does. When I tell him he can be anything in the entire world, I mean anything except for that. <laughs> so one other bit of news that we received, from what it sounds like, it shouldn't be too, too scary right now and hopefully not down the road. They made it sound like it would be okay, but several months ago, Jack went in for a checkup appointment and they heard a little murmur in his heart. They referred us to a specialist. We finally got an appointment and they ran all these tests on Jack, like had him hooked up to all these wires. It was actually kind of intense, but he did so good. Literally was calm the whole time. I was just like, who are you? But it was a little bit concerning why she was taking so long. And then finally at the end, the doctor said, the main arteries on your heart, the thing that lets blood flow through those arteries to your vital organs in your body are called little valves. And so the valve, on the artery that pumps blood into his lungs. That little valve is a little bit swollen because it's like a little bit smaller of a space for that blood to get through. The blood has to really force itself through and creates this sound, like that murmuring sound that she's hearing. And obviously anything related to the heart is freaky and the doctor acknowledged that and acknowledged all of our concerns, but she did say that it's okay right now. If anything did happen down the road, potential heart surgery would have to happen 
happen, but she said that it could just stay the same for the rest of his life, but it's something we'd have to check up on pretty much every year for the rest of his life. So, kind of insane, but at the same time, it could just be something really mild and not affect him at all. He doesn't seem to have any issues with energy and with stamina, so I think he might be okay. Uh, but just definitely something we have to monitor. It just sucks when it's like anything related to the heart obviously is scary and anything happening to your kid is freaky. Not the best news, but it's okay. He's good. We have another checkup appointment in a few months and then she'll be able to tell us if it's progressively gotten worse or if it's staying the same. So kind of hard to tell at this point, yeah. especially with him being so young. And anyways, it's time for water balloons. It's time for water pops. Yeah. Go do them, Jack. I got Sunny. She's right here. Let's go do the water pops, yeah? Toesies. She does have tiny toesies. That didn't work with Sunny, so I gave her back to Sarah. She's gonna go to sleep now. <laughs> she did not like that carrier at all. Ready? Whoa! How's the bathroom coming? Good. You guys wanna know the funny part is that I didn't even clean the bathroom after losing. But you did ask me to go watch the kids while you cleaned. Yes. So it worked out. Well, I actually put Sunny down. But Jack, yeah. I'll I'll clean the rest. It's good. But I lost. It's it's my due. It's your my duties. duties. It's your duties. It's my duties to clean the bathroom. Your snooties. Ooh, Sunny's awake. Frick. Okay. That's enough. We're gonna see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, and give this a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. You guys are amazing. Love you all. See you next time. Bye. Bye.